Hello friends, today I teach you how to upload your website on GoDaddy server in few seconds. Does not matter which language you develop your language, just go with me. First one, uh, you go your local machine, zip your website because GoDaddy server does not allow to upload your website, uh, uh, your direct, direct, directories on GoDaddy hosting. First, uh, this is a my website test website here is two html pages and one php page here is three directories folders css images and js okay now right click my website folder send to click on zip file okay now my website in zip click on your browser click Click on your URL bar, enter godaddy.com. After click sign in option, <coughs> okay. Enter your username or password. I already fill my username password. Okay, now proceed. Okay, now open my account. Here I see multiple options. Now click on your web hosting option, click on manage. <clears throat> if you have only single website hosting panel, so your domain show here, but I have multiple domains, so click on manage. This is my another domain. Okay. okay this screen show your authentication mode here go daddy server check your authentication to log in your hosting where you upload your website content directory something or other settings now here appear my hosting panels i have multiple domains so i have see there multiple hosting panels okay this is a domain totally free unused domain for by me if your uh, hosting panel does not show show here click on here add new domain enter your domain name clicks on save after show same panel in your hosting with your own domain name okay now I have uh, I upload website on this domain all visa dot in click here on file manager uh, file manager otherwise click on show more here you see all options your website click on file manager does not matter where you click opens what open same page where you upload your document file manager or files now I click on files directly. Okay. These files upload by me. What if you first time you upload your website, you see here some other files like default index something. You click here, select, select on or remove files. Okay. Click on just. Yes. Your all files successfully removed your from your domain file manager. Okay, now click upload files. Click here. Find your zip file, your website zip file. Okay, this is a zip file of my test site. Click okay. This website content uploaded successfully without using and without using any FTP. Okay, now click on here. Select your file go to more options click on extract files click ok now you see here their test site folder what i want to my all files out of this folder so click on this folder click here for select all four files and directories like css images and gs 
now click on move okay move choose your domain where you want to move your files if you have only single domain hosting uh, plus hosting to move your files on HTTP, http docs folder if other folder created by you okay your own name but now i move my files all visa.in directory okay my file successfully moved here click on on user.in refresh your page here i see my website contents directory css images and js like something which you choose in your website here my zip file of my website or a here is a folder which you file already moved okay moved. <coughs> now i explain windows plus hosting always starting page is index.html by default set html uh, sorry index.html php dot uh, index.php index.aspx does not matter which you develop your language already extension save with extension to your start page now i do not set my start page but now i go to next tab add my domain name or visa dot in <coughs> now just see welcome to test website index page successfully opened because my by default i set my uh, index page index dot html okay if you want to want to set your uh, start page like login otherwise here i upload I upload another file home.php this is a totally different from index.html index.php index.aspx go to your setting website and domains if you want to set your manually your start page of your website okay here you see uh, your hosting panel click here see we are work on this domain all visa dot in click on show more <coughs> click on show more click web server settings Uh, sorry for slow internet it takes uh, several minutes uh, okay, 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 okay 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 it opens successfully okay recently i upgrade here my start page of website but godaddy hosting plus hosting or linux hosting already set here index.html index.php index.aspx something different what i have now now I have different page name with, with my customized settings like home dot home dot I want to set my uh, page name home dot php okay so I enter here my customized name php dot uh, home dot php sorry friend for mistakes okay click on okay here in light way show please wait option it may be settings or updated in process updating process okay. <clears throat>
okay the settings were successfully updated okay now you go to your again your next tab or tab type your domain name now you see here sorry friend for slow internet it is uh, not my side it is the internet fault <coughs> okay i try to another tab all these are dot in it always take us several uh, seconds after updating your home pages like or website contents okay now your home page successfully updated now i show you here is not never show your home page always okay uh, home dot php this is a, your home page so friends if you use your different language like php or asp or you are create dynamically website i teach you how to connect with the database or hide your web pages extension like dot php dot aspx okay here is the ASP settings with your connect with your online MS SQL server, MySQL server connections. <coughs> Thank you, friends, for watching my video. Like, share, and subscribe.